Hi, it's Mike from Mike's Unboxing Reviews and How To, and on today's video, we are going to be taking a look at how to disable or possibly enable Windows Copilot on the latest Windows update for Windows 11. Some people may like it, some people may not want to have it on their systems. It is installed as a default for some of the latest Windows updates, so some of you may find it an unwelcome appearance on your desktop. So let's go over to the PC and I'll show you how to configure it or to remove it in its entirety. So this is our Windows 11 desktop and we've currently got all the latest updates installed. And you'll probably notice at the bottom here, you've got Copilot, which is uh, currently in preview, but it is installed and it does work. So normally you'd click on this and it brings up your Windows Copilot here over on the side and you can ask it all kinds of questions and it is all powered by Bing chat and uh, a good helping of AI. But again, some people don't like it and just don't need it on their systems. So let's take a look how to remove it. So first of all, you can actually just disable the ability to click on it. So in order to do that, click on start, go to settings, head over to personalization, scroll down to taskbar, and on here you can remove other things such as your widgets, chat, etc. task view, as I've done already, got rid of those. And you've also got Copilot Preview. So if you change the toggle from on to off, you see straight away the actual box is now gone. Now you can still bring it up by pressing a combination of Windows hotkeys and it is still available if you go through the search menu. So if you want to get rid of it in its entirety, what we're gonna to need to do is to go into the group policy editor. So click on start and in this top section, just type group or start typing it and you can choose this one, which is edit the group policy. Now in the group policy, you wanna go down to user configuration, administrative templates and expand that. And then you wanna go down to windows components and expand that. And there's a whole host of them here. Scroll down until you find windows copilot and click on it. And you'll see there's an option here for turn off windows copilot. So highlight, right click and choose edit. And currently, in its state, it's not configured. So if you read what it says there, it tells you basically if not configured or disabled is selected, Windows Copilot will still exist. And because this is an option for turn off Windows Copilot, we want to set it to enabled, which is a little bit counterintuitive, but it does the right thing. So set this to enabled, click on apply, click okay, close down your windows, you'll still see possibly that the icon may still be there if you've got it installed. All you wanna do is to click on start and do a quick reboot and you'll find that it is no longer available on your system. So there you go, pretty straightforward, relatively straightforward thing to do. Unfortunately, I would imagine that with future Windows updates, it may still install itself, but don't worry, it's quite easy to go in and actually remove it should you need to. It may actually look at the Windows policies when the next update is done and prevent it from being installed, but as always, time will tell. So there you go, there is how to remove Windows Copilot on your Windows 11 machines. Hopefully the video's been useful, it has, smash that like button. If you want to see more content like this on a daily basis, then hit subscribe and the chime notification and you'll be notified of future video releases. But for now, I've been Mike, this is Mike's Unboxing Reviews and How To, and hopefully we'll catch you in the very next video. Thanks for watching.